Today I want to show you how to do OLS and IV regression in Stata. We will use this uh, quality of governance dataset where I've navigated to the standard dataset and you just press Stata and it downloads it for you. Um, we open it in Stata and, and here we have it. So let's say that we want to um, regress GDP, some, some measure of GDP per capita can check it. measures of GDP here. We see that there is one measure of real GDP per capita. We can use this measure. And then we want to regress this on, on uh, let's say, property rights institutions. So we put reg, and we can then push this real GDP per capita. There is some property rights institutions in this huge data set called F HFP rights. And we want to have robust standard errors. We run that, just pressing enter. And here we have the result. So let's say that we want to put this in in a table in Excel with, 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 with other columns here. So we write outbreak two using, then we name it uh, tab. We want Excel output. And we want um, this to be the first column. By pushing the uh, page up button, I can recall my pre previous um, regressions. Let's say I want to add another variable, a, a control variable here. That could be absolute latitude. We put that in there. And use our outreck command, putting append instead. And we can then see our table here. This is how it's going to look, and another regression will, will then come here. Okay. Let's say we realize that the property rights institutions are endogenous. We want to do an IV regression, and we've heard of this fabulous instrument by Asimoglu Johnson Robinson called Settler Mortality. So this is how we write it. And press enter. Here are our IV results. We see that, um, so we use the Kleibergen PAP F statistic. This is the, the heteroscedasticity robust first stage statistic. It tells us whether our instruments are strong. As a rule of thumb, this should be larger than 10. So our instruments um, are strong. Let's see if, uh, if the first stage it really makes sense. We uh, put a first here, press enter, and we see our first stage results here that um, settler mortality indeed has a negative effect on property rights institutions. So that makes sense.